Hey, what is going on guys? I am back and I am bringing you the first ever episode of my GM Connected updates or recap of the week. And this is the first week, so I did not simulate anything. There are a few trades that went on, but I don't think I could show you them. But let's just take a look at the league standings. Remember, this is all random rosters, so it's not like Penguins have a Crosby and Malkin. Everything is completely random. So the Sharks are leading in the West, and myself, which is Tampa, is leading in the East, but Carolina is one point behind us. And most of the teams played. I looked at a list real quick, one second. If you are Penguins, Buffalo, Columbus, Edmonton, Vancouver, Toronto, St. Louis, Minnesota, or New Jersey, you really need to play your games, guys. If not, you will be kicked. And, uh, yeah, that's someone on the Flyers. But um, you need to play your games or you'll be kicked. I mean, I'm not trying to rush everyone. I mean, this has been up for, like, two days. Uh, it's just... Uh, it's just, like... <laughs> No one is playing their games, and I'm, I'm not trying to make it too, like, not playing, like, oh, 100 games in a day, but I finished my five games, no, yeah, my four games in, like, an hour. It wasn't that hard. I mean, it took two days, and I finished my four games in one day, and some people didn't even play a game yet. So, I mean, come on, you guys could play at least two games a day, and it only takes about, like, 12, 15 minutes, so it's not that hard. So if you're not going to be that active, you could leave, or I'll just kick you because... I want to do quick simulations. I actually want to go to the next season. I don't think I've ever seen a GM Connected League that actually went to like a season two or something like that. Because people take like, oh, let's do, let's simulate every seven days. That For me, that's way too long. I want to simulate every three to five days. And because I think three days will be easy. I mean, you only play like five games a week. And a game takes 12 minutes. So it's not that hard. I mean, if you guys aren't up for it, though, you could leave the thing. But I just want to be active. And if you guys don't care that I simulate some of your games, then you could stay. But... I'd prefer, because then the other person you have to play is going to get their game simulated, so I prefer that you guys just leave if you don't think you're going to be able to be that active. I mean, there's going to be three to five days of, uh, three to five games, and you have three to five days to play them. So you can play a game a day, but I'm not going to be like the person that says, oh, you have seven to ten days till I simulate, and no, that's way too long. It, it just, you just get, like, taken away from this. Like, if I, if it's every ten days, and you play all your games in one day, you're going to be like, nah. And I'll just, uh, I won't come back in this because there's no point. But let me just show you my team real quick. Coaching options, edit lines. I traded Rick Nash and Gianta and uh, Fisher. So those three are gone on my team. You'll see who I get in the next episode. But Havlat, Datsuk, Nash, Aginla, Savar, Gianta, Fisher, Peverly, Kopetsky, Bernier, Hanzus, and Malhotra. Hamhuis, Markov, Bowmeister, Stewart. Robodas and Allen. Markov I also traded. So it was a pretty big trade, I have to say. It was definitely the biggest trade out there yet. And Volkun and Anderson are my goalie. So my team is actually extremely good, I'm not going to lie. But, I mean, I am. I think I could get a better goalie, and I could get more depth. But I think it's really good, honestly, compared to some teams. There's some other really good teams, and there's some, some bad teams. But let's just take a look at the stats real quick. Team standings. Let's really quickly, I just want to make these episodes like five to eight minutes long, but so the most wins is me and Carolina are tied, most points, me, Carolina, so it's like that, but some teams, like Carolinas, they're 3-0, San Jose is 2-0, Capitals are 2-0, goals four, I'm leading with 15, goals four per game, oh, Carolina's averaging six, uh, Colorado's averaging six, excuse me, um, Dallas is averaging four. And I'm averaging 3.75 goals against. I'm averaging two. And power play goals. I have the most with four. I'm 40% in the power play out of 10 tries. So that's pretty good, actually. Penalty kill. A lot of people are 100%. I'm 85.7. Home, I'm 2-0-1. And in a way, I'm 1-0. And uh, that's pretty much it. Let me show you my... The, let me show you the player individual stats and where they uh how many points they get and stuff like that but yeah i just really want to make this really active guys i mean i hope you understand yeah that guy's even saying to play uh some of the people but it's just i just really want to make this active i mean how hard is it to play like, two games a day 
I mean, that's honestly extremely easy. That's going to take 30 minutes of your day. I'm pretty sure you could play three games a day, and that would be like, oh, yeah, that's fine, but no more than that. But three games a day, come on. And uh, let's see. Stats, we have goals. Datsuk leading our team with Hav uh, Havlat and Savard, Peverly. Oh, wait, no, I was going to say, I don't think all these players are leading the team, uh, league. That was just um, me. So Datsuk is leading in goals for me. He has double more than anyone else. Assists, Aginla is leading the team for me with four, but he's tied with a bunch of people. Points, Datsuk in first with seven. Crosby has five points in one game, so he'll probably catch up to everyone. We got Havlat, Aginla, three people in the top uh, eight. Uh, penalty minutes, Kane with six, plus minus. There's a lot of fives and fours and threes. Power play goals, Datsuk with three. Shorthanded goals, uh, Kamalari with two. Game winning goals, Gotch with one, and he's tied with like a hundred other people. Game tying goals, Booth with two. Miller with one. Shots, nah. A lot of 100% shooters. Face off wins, Datsuk is leading. Hits Lucic, Zajac, and Datsuk. I wouldn't, like, I wouldn't expect to see Datsuk up there, but okay. Giveaways, Timonen. Takeaways, Gianta. There you go, Gianta. Minutes, Char is leading the whole league. And let's take a look at goalies. Mason, Dubnik, Smith, Elliott, Pavlik, Price, and Quick are all under one goals against average. Quick, Volkun, both have three wins. Um, goals against average, Howard has the most against with Volkun in second, tied with Rene. Save percentage, Mason 100, Dubnik 96, and then all these other above average goalies, and Halak is, is, he's at average, and then everyone else is below. Shots against, Kiprasov has the most shots against him, and any Quick and Volkun both have an assist. I don't think any goalies have a, yep, any goalies have a penalty minute? Nope. And uh, that's pretty much it for the standings and stuff. But I just want to say one more thing, guys. If you have yet to play a game or if you only played one game, please message me saying that either the other person isn't on. You can message me on YouTube or on Xbox. Don't comment, but message me saying the other person isn't playing you or isn't on if you are trying to actually be active. And if you are not, like if, you're just, if you just went in and played one game and like, yeah, I'm not really feeling it, please just leave, honestly. No offense, but I'm just trying to make this really active because for me... In all the GM connected leagues I joined, people who wait like six, I mean, uh, seven to ten days to simulate, it just honestly takes away from the experience and it makes it a little bit more, like it kind of takes you out of the, the GM connected. Because me, I played all my games in one day. It took like an hour, maybe an hour and a half to play the four, no, yeah, no, no, it took me like an hour and ten minutes, hour and fifteen minutes to play the four games and I'm all done. And then I have to wait like three days because I don't want to simulate now, but I'd have to wait like three more days to simulate. And for me, like, I can't really do anything in this, so it kind of takes me out of this. But I want to have a goal where I'm going to simulate every three to five days. I'm not sure if I'm going to do three or five. Maybe I'll do four to split it right in the middle, but I feel like anything more than five is too much. I would do two, but that's definitely too little. So it's going to be three to five days. Um, once I simulate, I will have a schedule of when I will be simulating. But guys, please be active, honestly. If you're not going to be active, just leave. If the person isn't playing, tell me. And uh, that's pretty much it. And if you guys want to join, please send me a message because there probably will be people kicked. Probably at least six people will be kicked in the next week. And if you guys want to join, please leave it in the comments. But thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you enjoy this series. And you guys will see the trades that happen next week. And before I go, let's try to do something a little bit here. Let's go to the GM options and free agency. And let's try to pick up someone. Since we did trade... Markov, I want to try to pick up a defenseman, but as uh, GM Connected always takes about an hour to load things, you might be sitting here for some time. Okay, there we go. So, Gonchar, hmm. Uh, he's kind of a little bit too much money. Yager would be nice to replace GM. You know what? But eight teams are interested in him, so... I don't think that's going to work. I mean, we could go with, like, Gill or... Uh... Hmm. So, eight teams want Yager, so it's not going to work for us. 
I would want to get him, but people, pr I bet you someone at least put 3.5 million into him, so that's not going to work. We did lose about 5 million in cap space, which I don't know if this is going to actually work. I mean, it says we only have 1.5, and yeah, we can't even go higher than that. So we're going to just try to do this, I guess. I don't know if Zidlicki's going to accept it because it's only half of what he wants, but we do have a lot more than that. It's just because we have to simulate. But look at my, look at that. I have double the right wingers in, uh, that I need. I have almost double the centers that I need. I have plenty of defense, and I have max goalies. But look at left wings, one out of six. Well, that was the end of the episode, guys, or the end of the recap show. What should I call this series? And if you guys want to join, make sure you message me, because there will be people who are kicked. And, uh, yeah, that is pretty much it. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys later.